Hey everyone, it's Coach Sue with Greater Richmond Fit for Kids. I'm here with my cat, Nora. We're going to talk to you today about matter. Um, in this activity, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over some changes of state of matter, and then we're going to do an exercise the answer activity. If you're ready to get started, follow me over here. So, Nora, I said over here. This way. I'm going to do a quick demonstration to show you many of the changes of states of matter. First, we're going to start out with a solid. We're going to add heat to that solid to get it to melt, to form a liquid. Then we're going to take that liquid, continue to add heat in order to get it to evaporate and form a gas. Then we're going to take that gas, we're going to cool it down in order to get it to condense and form a liquid again. It's important that you have a safe space for the activity that we're going to do. What's going to happen is a question is going to come up on the screen, which I'll read through as well as the answer choices. You need to figure out what your answer is to the question. Once you've decided, you're going to do the exercise that matches that answer as soon as you know it. Ready? Let's find out what the movements are. These are the four movements that we're going to use for the activity. Each one's going to be demonstrated by an animated picture of Coach Suho doing the activity. So if you forget which one's which, don't worry. It's going to show up next to the question. A will be arm circles, B are basketball shots, C are cross crawls, and D are sky reaches. Let's get into our first question. A blank settles to the bottom of a container and doesn't have a shape of its own. Is it A, solid, B, liquid, C, gas? or D, molecule. You should be doing basketball shots because the answer is B, liquid. This phase of matter has its own definite shape. A, solid, B, liquid, C, gas, D, atom. For this, you should be doing arm circles because A, Phase of matter with its own definite shape is a solid. A is the answer. Anything that takes up space. A, volume. B, mass. C, matter. D, weight. The correct answer here is C, cross crawls. C is matter. Anything that takes up space is matter. Adding heat will result in blank. A, melting, B, freezing, C, condensation, D, evaporation. There could be two answers here. Depending on what you're adding heat to, it could either A, melt that object, um, if it is a solid, those would be arm circles, or it would D, evaporate that object if it was a liquid. So sky reaches. So either A, melting, or D, evaporation is correct. Cooling a liquid makes a blank. A, atom, B, liquid, C, gas, D, solid. There's only one right answer here. That is D, solid, sky reaches. Cooling a gas to make a liquid is called blank. A, melting, B, freezing, C, condensation, D, evaporation. The correct answer is C, condensation, cross crawls. When you cool a gas to make a liquid, you're condensing that gas into a liquid. What is the state of matter that has a definite volume but no definite shape? A, liquid, B, gas, C, solid, D, atom. The correct answer here is A, arm circles, liquid. A liquid has a volume, but it takes the shape of whatever container it's put into. When salt dissolves in water, the result is a blank. A, concentrate, B, solution, C, solvent, D, solute. The best answer here is B, basketball shots, solution. 
two or more substances that are mixed together but can be separated from each other form a blank. A, mixture, B, gas, C, liquid, D, solvent. The best answer here is arm circling because A, mixture, is your answer. If enough heat is taken away from a container of water, what will happen to the water? A, it will begin to boil. B, it will turn into a gas. C, it will increase in weight. D, it will become a solid. Taking heat away is the same as cooling, so then you will end up with D, sky reaches. It will become a solid. An example of a liquid turning into a gas is blank. A, steam escaping from a cup of hot tea. B, ice melting in a drink. C, an apple getting juiced. D, water droplets forming on blades of grass. Your best answer is arm circling because steam escaping from a cup of hot tea is a liquid turning into a gas or evaporating. Particles in a blank are the farthest apart and move the fastest. A, solid, B, gas, C, atom, D, liquid. You should be doing basketball shots for this because the answer is B, gas. Time to get in a nice ceiling stretch. As you can see in the video, you're going to reach up towards the ceiling. You're going to hold it and then you're going to come on down. So let's breathe in. And breathe out. Back in. And out. Thanks for moving and learning with us today. Don't forget to like this video and follow us for more resources. We are Greater Richmond Fit for Kids.